Hey guys, welcome back. I'm gonna make this pretty quick today. I've been making videos, but I haven't been posting them. I just wanna make them shorter and shorter because it takes a while to make them. Let's go over the taxes regulations that's just been signed. It's not effective to 2023, but what this tells me is nothing may happen until then because they want these regulations to be effective when they know the money is gonna start flowing through XRP. That's how I see this. I'm hoping it does, XRP does go up this year or even next year, but these regulations uh, is to make sure they get their money. Now I just go through a bunch of little news and I'll put it all together. I've been following the Metaverse projects, which is gonna be huge. This is, this is what the elites want to do, to put all of us in this Metaverse, and to make this world boring. So I've been looking for projects that are associated with this metaverse and I've been trying to invest in them. Especially with Facebook, now Meta is involved in this metaverse project. And don't be fooled by Microsoft and, and this news here because they're all on the same team. There's no competition at all. So after seeing the Facebook metaverse program, I started to see Paris Hilton promoting Decentraland and as soon as I saw that and I saw Decentraland pop up, I bought into it. I made uh, I made double my money and I, I got out. So it pays to know how the how the world kind of connects because these, these elites, they use the entertainers and our famous people to promote whatever they want to promote. XR Doge, I think XR Doge is going to be huge. It has a hundred billion supply which is pretty much like XRP and it's already one zero away from being a penny. And I think they're really gonna use this to pretty much fight against Shiba. Because Shiba is under Ethereum, XR Doge is under the XRP Ledger. And trading on like the, the Zoom app, the XUMM app, it's so much easier than, than trading on these swaps and stuff like that because you're not worried about the fees. And the transactions, 99% go through. And I really think these Zoom applications and Sologenic and setting up the XRP ledger to go against the Ethereum network. And I think X, XR Doge is going to be the front man to get adoption. Because what they, I think what the elites wanna do here is have you put all your XRP into XR Doge. That way you'll be happy. They're gonna, they're gonna show you gains in XR Doge. It's gonna go up you'll, and the normal person's gonna be happy. But it's XRP is the one that's gonna be much higher. So what I'm doing is I'm just I got into XR Doge when it was four zeros with some of my XRP. And so far it's paying off. Like if I see no movement in XRP, I'm just like, okay, well XR Doge is going up. And I have something to look at while we're, I'm waiting for XRP pretty much. And as the US dollar uses the oil industry to create demand for it. This is creating demand for XRP. This these applications because you have to use XRP to put in this app and yet and that's what you're gonna use to buy these coins using this ledger network and even these NFTs are on the ledger network like X dude so this creating a demand for this uh, XRP and it's burning the XRP at the same time even though the fees are really low 0 0.000 whatever one two it's really good. All right, I promised that was gonna be quick. One more thing, a health tip. If your knees are effed up, you need to stop eating processed foods. Go get some greens and vegetables, cook those, eat those. Go, go to a restaurant that serves lots of vegetables. That's what you need to eat. And I don't mean just broccoli, I mean like different kinds. And your knees will get better. All right, guys, that's all I got. Thanks, see ya. Bye.